Hi, it's Michelle from Early Intervention TV and Movement Lesson, and I'm here to talk to you about feet on little guys and gals. One of the things that happens when our children, specifically if they're born premature or they're in the hospital at a very young age, is that uh, there actually is a very good vein down around the ankle and doctors like to use that for an IV versus putting it in the hands. The problem with that is that first of all, there's pain involved, which unfortunately you can't stop the IV, so, so don't beat yourself off over that. Um, but there's also the weight of the IV restricts movement of the foot. Okay, no big deal. Yes, it is a big deal because movement is crucial when children are just infants and babies. Even a child in NICU or a situation that the preemie is just that small, just the weight of the diaper is going to restrict movement within the pelvis. So you want to take some di the diaper off and actually allow that floor time for the pelvis to actually function and move and not be restricted by just the bulk and weight of the diaper. It sounds silly, but it's just a little things that will add up on the child's development quite quickly because what you're establishing within the first few hours, if not months, days, uh, is this lifetime of learning that is reorganized due to these difficulties. You'll particularly see these with a the child if they have severe CP and the, the foot um, is almost in a sense to uh, parents and doctors looking as non-functioning and that's where you're, they're, they're actually placed in an orthotic um, to restore and keep that 90 degree angle of the foot. Um, that's not there because the brain actually is act incapable of speaking with the foot. And that's one of the things that um, I go after looking for to uh, restore that, that communication, that function with the foot. You'll see this, this child that I'm working on, he's four, um, and you'll actually get to see him being able to wiggle his toes for the first time. Uh, he has cerebral palsy. He's learned to walk about um, a year ago. We started working together in August. Within about three weeks, he was up and walking. We still have a lot of um, things that we're working on to actually drop the foot down, to bring it down. Um, and bring function back into the lower extremities, but uh, he's a little cute little guy and um, he's doing really well. Thanks. Detailed work is really overlooked by a lot. Mm -hmm. Looking at so cool. Mm -hmm. Even if it's just a little bit here and there. A lot of kids with CP or NICUs. NICU meaning that they have premature birth or the IV them to the ankle. Just a good vein, versus the, but it immobilizes the feet almost instantly. You know, yeah. you can usually tell when they IV foot they're more turned in and very thin here. I mean, you can ask, don't assume, but yeah. A lot of kids with CP or NICUs, NICU meaning that they have premature birth or they IV them to the ankle. Just a good vein, versus the, but it immobilizes the feet almost instantly. You know, you can usually tell when they IV foot they're more turned in and very thin here. I mean, you can ask, don't assume, but yeah. But they learned at birth because the reason is the IV is not only just the trauma, but the weight of the IV. You've got tape, you've got the weight of the tube. Yeah, sure. And that just immobilizes the foot. Yeah. Okay. We gotta get, we gotta get another one. Oh. Hmm? I want, Michelle, I want that ball, please. Wait. You're alright. Yeah. Detailed work is really overlooked by a lot. Mm -hmm. Looking at so crucial. Mm -hmm. Even if it's just a little bit here and there. There we go. Can you see the difference now in the toes? Yeah. There. Hey, you. Whoa. Whoa, 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 whoa. Is he moving up? Ah. Hey, what's this? Can you see the difference now? Mm-hmm. That's a medicoid. Hmm. Here, Mom, look. I'm a medicoid. Ouch, ouch. Oh, he moved his toe. Load it. Get down, get down. It's not contracted, any of them. Oh, you think... I'm going to try to move over your toes, baby. Oh. Okay. He's not even listening. Can you curl them? Can you do this, Papa? Your toes? 
Wiggle him. Go up. Wiggle up. We'll make him go up. I can't. Okay, let's try. Mm. What? I can't do it. Does you it know? hurt? Yeah, but... No, no, no. Look what we did with your foot feet today. Look, you see your toes see. move. See, before it's they were like this. Your feet, oh, your yeah. feet change. Now they can move. So curl them. Look, look, see? There oh you my go. god, yay! That's High awesome! Five. High five. <laughs> Me? It's because we have company. Oh, he, he gets kind of like. Can we do another wiggle? No. Do it again. One more time. Do it again and I'll buy you popcorn. <gasps> That's awesome, Papa Cito! Pretty cool, huh? That is awesome. Those Good your job. Feet. Magic toes. It's because. I want to show daddy. Okay. Good job. <laughs>